All right. Welcome back to another segment of Reading with DJ Andre. Today, I have a great book by Margot McGank, People Are Wild, selected by the one and only Mr. B. Thank you very much. It seems like an interesting book. You know, I'm an animal lover, so when I see books referring to animals, I definitely get intrigued by them. It says, wild creatures come in all shapes and sizes. They can be playful or loud or curious or cute, just like kids. People are wild turns the tables and asks what animals think of us. So pretty much not what we think of animals. What do animals think of us as humans? We may not always see eye to eye, but the more we understand each other, the better we are able to live in harmony. And that's just to start the book off. You know, we even got into the book yet, and I'm already excited. People Are Wild by Margot McGank. Mama, what is that? Can you tell which child is asking what is that? That's a person. Who's saying that? Don't get too close. Why not? Because people are wild. Honk, honk, honk. Marco, Polo, Polo, Polo. And so loud. And as you see in the illustrations, they explain how loud we can be. So messy. Look at that. We can be messy at times, I'll admit it. So smelly and so nosy. Oh my goodness. This is what the animals think of us. This is not my doing. This is what the animals think of us. Such strange creatures. Hmm. But mama, people are also just like us. They are funny. I can be funny at times. Sometimes. Not all the time. At least I think. And cuddly and cute. Each one unique and such fun to watch. Oh, mama, can we keep her? No, little one. They wanna keep that child. People are wild. And all wild creatures should be free. Like those two elephants. The mother and the baby. And that ends our book on People Are Wild. 
On the back, it says, what does an elephant see when it looks at you? That's something to think about. You know, I know a lot of times, you know, when we look at animals, we think things of them, but take time to really like wonder, what do animals think of when they, they look at you? You know, do they think you're funny, cute, nosy, smelly? You never know. It's a good perspective to look at. Um, this is a good book. I enjoyed it. Um, like I said, I'm, a, I'm an animal lover. So I always think about, you know, what goes through, through their mindsets when they see us. Do they feel danger like when we see a lion or a tiger or a gorilla? Or do they feel comfortable and safe around us? Something to think about. Till next time, reading with DJ Andre.